Hello everybody and welcome back to A Plague Tale Innocence. Uh, the last time we played, we, uh, we made our way through a field that was extremely frustrating. And then uh, we made our way out of an encampment after we got captured. And now we're on the run. Um, we're still running away from the dude with the big, uh, big cross helmet. And, uh, yeah, we're on, uh, we're on chapter seven. So the Inquisition paid the English garrison a ransom to get Hugo and Amicia. Luckily, Amicia and the, and Hugo, why well, don't I say the boy, managed to escape the camp with the unexpected help of the raiders. Uh, is it Meal, I believe? Or, 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 uh, no, it's like, uh, Melly and Arthur. Is it Melly and Arthur? Um, so yeah, we're, uh, we're getting out of there, basically. Um. We're still running from the Inquisition, guys. Uh, surprisingly, they paid the ransom. They really just want Hugo, to be honest. Uh, which makes me wonder, really, why why is Hugo so important? What is this thing in his blood that makes him so important? Like, is it like a supposed to be like a cure to the plague or something? Because, I mean, he seems susceptible regardless. All right, so, um... Tell me. Yeah. What the hell are you doing with the Inquisition after you? What's so special oh, about know. the little guy? It's... I still don't complicated. know that. And what about your brother? Will he be all right? He'll catch up with us. He really saved our lives. It was incredible. Hey, don't get all lovey-dovey. He'll break your poor little heart. Um, I, no. <laughs> I'm in! Yeah, we're going to use it to cross. What? Oh, what are those birds? Dock here. Ducks. Oh, like the ones we eat? Yes, and they eat frogs. That's life. I'm not interrupting anything, am I? Uh, come on, it's not a good idea to stay here. Is he always like that? He hasn't seen much of the world. This isn't the best moment to start. No shit, right? First one to the middle way. Can... Slow down. It's closed. I'll do it. Yeah, that's right. She can lockpick shit. Open. Just looking oh, to where the next collectible is. It's for crushing the wheat. Yeah, but it hasn't been used in quite a while, clearly. There's cobwebs all over. All right, we have some stuff here. I'm gonna be like full up on everything because I still have not gotten any fucking work tools. Too strong. How are we going to get across? Well, stopping it. Well, we need how to, we stop, to it. stop it. Amicia, we'll find a way. The current's slowing down, but not enough. There must be something else. Yeah, we need to just slow the... Yeah, but... Hugo, can you take care of it? Yes. 
Can he though? Amicia, you're not leaving without me, are you? I'm coming, Hugo. I'm just trying to find a way to get you across. <laughs> you sound like Arthur. Stop. Mm. Yes. I can help you from the other. Can you do it, Melly? Yeah, there you this go. Is where so we see if go. we hold up. Well, doesn't look like I'll be taking a bath today. Hold on. Okay. Okay, now he can run over. And there you go. See? Simple. There we go. We beat the mill. If the Inquisition make it this far, that'll hold them up for a while. Finally, some fucking work tools! Uh, okay, so there's a lock in front of this door. Well spotted. Oh, nice. Thanks. And this is where the, uh... Come on, Lenny. We're going to try and get up. Yep. What about me? We'll be back soon, I promise. Very well. Hmm. Not much here. Yeah, there's a collectible here. Horseshoe. So, as quality of life improves, population size grows faster than food production, added to the various plagues befalling the crops. This makes famine take on a drastic dimension, I mean dramatic dimension, pushing poor and rich to superstition. Despite their new role as good luck charms, horseshoes are still expensive pieces of ironwork that are crucial to farming. Using them to attract luck is a major sacrifice for a farmer. But a little luck would be appreciated. <laughs> if luck was found on the Lord's tombs, then farriers would rule the world. Okay, so we can make. Um... God, you can make less noise. So I only have like one work tool, so. Uh, I want to do this. Huh. This should make things a little easier. See, I can still upgrade that, but I just don't have any more work tools. It pisses me off that I don't have like a lot of work tools because of that fact. We'll go through here. Come on. You trying to impress me or what? No. All right, come on. It's pretty here, and it smells like earth. Yankee Duck, is that where Lucas is? I hope so. I doubt this castle is going to look like much. Why? This used to be a village, but it was reduced to rubble in just one night, years ago. Some say there's a curse around these parts. Monsieur? Oh. She's joking, Hugo. Of course I am. When do I say anything true, eh? Do people live here then? Yes, but they left. Where did they go? Somewhere else. A bit like us. Oh. Oh, there we go. You know what that is? Hawthorn, I think. Nobody likes it because of the thorns, but it's good for the heart. Well, aren't you a fount of knowledge? Mommy taught me. You can teach me then. And will you teach me how to use this thing? It's a deal. So we got Hawthorn. A thorny bush used to mark out the borders of gardens and properties. Hawthorn has become a symbol of cautious hope. It is a subject of many legends, the most prestigious of which, it, uh, of which depicts it as Christ's crown of thorns. Uh, when ingested as an infusion, it regulates the heartbeat and combats shortness of breath. Oh, that's one of the symptoms of COVID. Somebody give me some Hawthorn. Need some Hawthorn. What were you up to? Just a detour. Bitch, you don't need to know what I'm up to. If I want to, like, 
look around? I'm gonna do that, alright? So shut the fuck up. Look in every goddamn house that I want to, man. Maybe I want to get a curse. Amicia. Hugo, what are you oh, doing? Oh boy, here we go. Come here. Oh. <laughs> Hugo. Hugo, look at me. Is it starting again? Your head. It's like... Have you looked at this kid's neck recently? Going inside. My legs. My legs are shaking. Don't say he's been bitten. It's not the bite. It's... Something in his blood since he was little. I'll have to carry him. Climb on my back if you can. Come on. He's got like Sorry. the veins on his neck, if it's man. In his blood. What about you? I'm fine. Lucas is trying to slow the effects down. That's also why we're going to the chateau. Amicia. I'm scared. Of what, Hugo? What's in my head? Don't worry. We're all scared of what's in our heads. Here we are. You'll be able to rest. At last. Help me lift this. Are there any work tools in here? I'm coming. Hugo, can you climb down, please? Oh, hell yeah. Look at this. Little, little hidden... Little hidden, uh, hidden room. Is this your house? It's a hideout, lad. It's meant for hiding out, not banquets with lords and ladies. Don't touch that. It's my brother's. That's where the lot that is. How long have you been living like this? Like ruffians and beggars, you mean? Like Family quotes tradition. and living, living Our dad quotes. Dad was a piece of rubbish. <coughs> Tried to beat us one time too many, so we skedaddled. But you, you're almost royalty. Royalty. <laughs> Monsieur. What does huh mean? I'm cold. Can't you see? Look at us. We've lost everything. What do you mean? Who's going to pay us then? What are you talking about? Your mate's Lucas. He said you're rich. Just I... forget it, all right? Take Arthur's straw mattress, and when he finally gets here, we'll have a proper discussion. I mean, I wouldn't say we were rich, but... Doesn't matter, our whole family's dead. Who's gonna pay us? Ain't nobody paying me for nothing. I gotta take my disabled ass brother to Chateau and it's not even and I'm not getting paid. Uh oh. So, see anything? What the hell are guards no, doing all the way out that. here in this curse ass village? Hey, men! This way! I need some help! Well, I guess we're sneaking out. Where does that go? Outside. Yes, but where? Just trust me. And your brother? He should have been here by now. Sorry. Don't give up on him just yet. He has a helmet. Ah, oh, Devorantis. What? Devorantis. So Peter and alcohol burns your face and melts steel. No one can keep their oh my helmet God. on with that. Get some ready. All right. Oh my God! Now we're crafting some. Go on. Aim for the helmet. Oh my God. Hit him on the head with a rock. Go on. Serves him right. It's noisy. Damn. Try to be a bit more enthusiastic, will you? He's right. It is noisy. Shit. Look. There's one with a helmet. You know what to do. Yes. If I find her. Any idea where the whetstones are? In one of the boxes. But it's an unholy mess. Oh 
First, Hugo, you uh, keep a lookout and stay quiet. All right. Understood. They're still looking for me. Horse. Just wait for him to turn around. Kids made a right mess of the English. I've never seen an explosion like it. My ears are still ringing. We got the one what did it though. A young thief who was helping to do rooms. He's being held at the Bastion for interrogation. He should think himself lucky. If he didn't have information about the boy, he'd be little chunks of meat by now. Oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. <sighs> Melly, I'm... No. Later. Okay, so... That noise. I think it came from over there. We haven't had to deal with a mess of the English. Nothing to report. <laughs> yeah, here's the thing. I was supposed to knock the uh, I was supposed to knock the guard out, but he has a helmet and I didn't want to waste anything, so I figured I would just like walk up. So I got it anyway, since I know that collectibles you can just grab. Uh, map. Widespread among noble and learned circles. Maps are rare and expensive as well as imprecise. That's why practical and inexpensive directional signs uh, proliferate the, at, road, um, at road intersections. The villages, sometimes located several days' walk of each other, are ravaged by famine, war, and disease. It is through the, the same roads that the plague travels, accompanying the fleeing populations who follow the saying, Leave quickly, go far, and come back late. Nicholas is going to be furious. Someone's going to get it in the neck. And Vitalis. What is that? You might think that Captain of the Guard is scary, but the old man, believe me, when Strange. he's disappointed, he burns people alive just to take his mind off it. He must be pretty damn special, young man, to merit all this nonsense. It's not my fault. And he's humble, too. What? Odd. See what it is. 
There's someone here! Get back here! Ah, oh, damn it. If we hadn't had to deal with the mess of the English camp, we'd have had him by now. Nicholas is gonna be furious. Someone's gonna get him in the neck. And Vitalis, you might think the captain of the guard is scary, but the old man, believe me, when he's disappointed, he burns people alive just to take his mind off it. You must be pretty damn special, young man, to merit all this nonsense. It's not my fault. And he's humble. Yeah, <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's get this jar ready here. Like, what? It's supposed to distract them, so why doesn't it? Nicholas is gonna be furious. Someone's gonna get it in the neck. And Vitalis. So, still nothing? No, they're only kids. Probably just hiding in the bushes somewhere. Well, a lot of men looking for just some kids. The Grand Inquisitor is pretty tough. Oh, Nicholas is used to it. They don't call him the Scarlet Monk for nothing. Sound. Nothing. So once he goes back over here, I'll be able to get these. Check it out. Come on, everybody, get the over here. How? Uh, first of all, the coast is clear. just I'm coming for the last time. I don't understand. I don't understand how he's like just seeing me. I'm not making any fucking noise, dude. I'm sick of this shit already. Like, I'm so tired of dealing with this bullshit. Like, they, they, I, I'm in the dark. Like, I don't understand how they're seeing me in the fucking dark. Like, I'm not near it. I'm not near the light. Like, you must be pretty damn special, young man, to merit all this nonsense. I'm so tired of doing this shit already. You can't fucking hear. Like, how are you supposed to get this stuff? You're gonna just sit here and waste materials to fucking get or the other materials. There's no point in getting any of these materials. Why put them there? Nearly there. You can't get them. What colors is down? There's always a side entrance. And I can't. And I can't like let's get do anything. Here. Come on. Yeah, let's get out of here without collecting anything, Go without getting so any materials. Jesus fucking Christ. It's not the it's not the it's not that the stealth is is hard. It's the fact that I want to be able to get stuff, you know, actually collect the materials that are around. The cart should be arriving soon with fresh supplies. They'll take you to the Inquisition Bastion in town. Amicia, do you have any Devarantis left? No. We'll make some. 
Quick! What? Hey, look at I'm so glad to see you again. Oh. Just like, I'm just... I heard that. And what about you, Lucas? How are you? Uh, can we talk while we run? Or we can sit down with some wine and some roast chicken and wait for them to come and kill us. What do you reckon? You're right. Let's get going. The chateau shouldn't be far now. Let's go. Come on. It's not far to the aqueduct. And it's not like... And the, the, the problem is, is that I can't you forgot to take out all the guards. You wouldn't have accepted the deal. The one where your friends are rich. But we'll sort it out. Tell my brother that. What's all this? An accident? An Inquisition cart. The rats. There must be things we can salvage from inside. I don't see how we can get past. Oh, Amicia, I have something for you. It's a byproduct of Ignifia. <laughs> Luminosa. You throw it into a pile of rats and... Anyway, you'll see. Here, take it. Uh, okay. Salt, eater, alcohol, and liver. Mix them together. All right. Let's see if there's anything else here. Throw it to the rats. It completely destroyed them. Lucas, the cart's packed full of our chemical material. Makes sense. The Inquisition. They couldn't have got as far as the Macula without reading their chemical writings. Well, that looks a lot better. Okay, so see, that's the thing. Like, no longer need to upgrade a workshop to upgrade. But see, I, I think that the thing that I really want is no longer needs tools to upgrade her equipment. That's what I really need. But I'm sure there's probably not a new game plus on this, so it won't even really matter. Okay, so uh, the next thing that we have, the next collectible, after seeing the chateau for the first time, or so the stairs and take a sharp left turn at the crossroads. Ask. Uh, the girl locked at the door. Okay. Yucky dog, we're nearly there. Fine. Like I said, I want to make this clear. It's not that it's not that the it's not that the the stealth is hard. It's just the fact that the guards. It's it's the stealth is like dishonored. It's not are. good. Yes. The the thing is is when it comes to stealth, I when you're the 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 idea of a video game stealth. Let me explain this. Let's just pause for a second. The idea of a video game stealth is that when you're in the dark, you cannot be seen. If you go into the light, that is when you can be seen in the dark. So the idea is, is that while I'm in the dark, I'm not supposed to be able to be seen. But the guards, they just see you regardless. If you're like within a certain like eye range of them. The problem is when I was trying to get that leather was that guy was walking away and I left. I even left Hugo there. And as I was walking out, he just turned around and saw me. That's not how the how it's supposed to work. Either they didn't do the stealth mechanics very well, or they've designed the AI to be... To, the, the AI just does whatever the fuck it wants. Which, in turn, is kind of stupid, considering that you've seen that the AI walks certain paths. So the idea is, is, as he walks back to where he was standing, I'm able to get the materials and go back in the bushes. It, you have to work out these kinks if you're going to make a game solely based on sneaking around and doing stealth-based stuff. If it doesn't work properly, then you, f then you have to fucking give me the ability to take out whoever I want whenever I want. You can't just say, oh, well, you have to sneak through everything and then also sneak to be able to get materials all while wasting 
your materials to Hugo, it's aqueduct. To oh. take out the guards. Aqu like the same well, materials I have to upgrade with aqueduct. are the same materials that I use to take out guards, which is really ridiculous Maybe. and annoying. Where's like I don't want to talk about it. Uh, all, all right. Oh. Well spotted. Come on, get up there. All right. Yeah, it's just like, and the thing is too, is just not having enough work tools is another problem. With, what? You know, not being able to upgrade. Is that it? There's nothing here. Lucas, I... Don't tell what? me we've done all this for nothing. No, no, no. Laurentius was smarter than that. It's an alchemist's trick. Gold is born from lead. The door shall only reveal itself to the one who has the key. Something like that. Mm. I prefer use your eyes before using your mouth. Who's going first? Nice one. Uh, Amicia? Come on then. We've come this far. That's my girl. The mechanics of this game are just what is wearing it down to me. Like, oh, wow. you know, the puzzles are cool. You know, like I said, and, oh. like I, and as I've said before, it's not hard. Not is that the sea? No, it's water that's collected underground. Hey, there's a pontoon. People used to use this place. I've, we're on the Never right track. Heard of it before. And the chateau? Where is it? Well, if you want to know, we'll have to get across first. <laughs> Damn it. He forgets. Well done. I mean, it's not that they don't give you enough materials either. You know, like, they, they do kind of, like, throw materials at you a lot. But, you know, you end up collecting a lot of stuff, and then you're always holding on to, like, you're full up on something, and then you can't take it, and a then... Reaction fairy. A what? A boat that's propelled by a rope. You pull it by hand. There's a hand crank. What's in here? Melly, can you look after it? Lucas, come and help instead of sleeping. Uh, yes, yes. The water's green. Oh, that's because there are a lot of things living in it. They must be very cold. Once, Father took us to the lake at Tulf, and I slipped and fell in the water. It was so cold, it made me cry. <laughs> I would have cried too. Your boat awaits. Shall I get in? Yes, Hugo, get in. I hope they can swim. Hold on tight. There you go. Whoa. We. I can't see any fish. Oh, that's because of the monster. What? A monster? Of course. The underground lakes are magical. Huge, ancient monsters hide in their depths. And watch out, they're very hungry. No, they're not. And if there were monsters, we'd see some big bubbles. <laughs> you got me. Mummy used to say that monsters are just those things... those things to... Just those things to which we have never given a name. She told me that too. I would quite like to see a monster, actually. Well, she's actually not wrong. Right, this is where we get off. Oh, it was too a lot quick. Of I know, but it's someone else's turn Creepy now. undersea monsters lurk in these underground cave depths. There are no monsters here, but there might be a whale. A whale is big, you know. Yes, but a little one. Why not? A shy whale that doesn't want to show itself. It's shy because it's small. But I'm sure it's pretty. Over to you! We're coming! P it's alright. You can let go. Mm-hmm. 
There we go. Scared. I forget it. It's all behind us now. Oh. But anything somebody? that takes my fancy at the castle is Board. mine, alright? Fair enough. Ah, uh, closed. Not for long. Make some room. Okay. I know that I've been complaining about all stealth and stuff, but I but it's let me open. let me tell you a few things that I do actually like about this game. I like the story thus far, I like the characters. Um, I like the idea of a sling as a weapon. I think it's pretty cool. Of course. I hadn't missed them a bit. And I like the rat stuff, like this. It's... Can't be. I have to see this from closer up. That... That pit. What, Lucas? Oh. Like a castle. A rat trap. Protecting something. And? How does it work? Easy. The braziers push the rats towards the pit and they get trapped there. Could be useful. Who built it? I don't know, but it looks ancient. Come on, Lucas. Let's take a look. Right, Melly. While the boys are daydreaming, we should get going. Who built this? Some, uh, hmm? some knight, perhaps? I don't think knights know how to use stolen hmm. water. Hmm. Craftsmen. There are a lot of those. Lucas? Yeah, go oh, on! Into the pit! We have to get to but the other side. The All right, come on. You're right. That gives me goosebumps. <laughs> Closed. Melly, can you open it? No. Maybe from the other side? All right. <clears throat> so... Uh, there's nothing else here, but we need to open that door for the... Boys to come through. Look at that. They, they like that's so gross. This is this is what I like about this game. I like this rat stuff. Like that stuff is really cool to me. Come, I'll get you up. Um, All right. Like I said, there's a lot of stuff I do like about this game. The mechanics I feel like are they need some some work, but I honestly feel like this game is is really cool. Like I love the setting. I love the the characters. I love the. Um, I love, like I said, I love the idea of the sling as a weapon. The story is fantastic. Uh, I mean, graphically, this game's actually really nice, too. Um, <laughs> All right, I'll take care of the door. Come on, cross over, you two. All right, so let's push these guys into the pit as well, eh? Look at them swarming by that. Look at that! They just catch fire when they you know where to go. The system. It's very go. efficient. What was this over here? A oh, rock, okay. Alcohol. I'll go first. I also like the automatic uh, climbing up and down of ladders. That's a, that's something in, in games that I love. I don't know if, if that's something people like, but sometimes I hate when I have to just, I have to f climb up a ladder by holding the thumbstick up. I love the automatic up and down climbing. Another door. Ladders. Maybe it's the right one. I just hope there are no rats behind it. Melly, need a little help here. On my way. Come on! I'm starting to get fed off of all these doors. Look! We found it! The castle! Whoa, Whoa, look at that. It really exists. Chateau d'Ambrage. It's amazing. 
Dude, this. Uh, oh, by the way, I also have to say what I, another thing I like about this game: the music. Creepy ass music. Oh, look, I see some rats in the distance. Fantastic. Fantastician! Alright, so our last collectible for this chapter is over here. Many, I need your help. Understood. That door, lady. So so far we've only missed one collectible because I wasn't using a guide at the time, but Is that supposed to be the miracle remedy they told? Vinegar of the Four Thieves. There is particularly widespread legend of four thieves who found a way to plunder contaminated houses without being struck by evil themselves. When they were finally stopped, the robbers were promised not to be burned at the stake if they revealed their secret. They agreed, making the details of the mysterious recipe public and were hanged on the spot. The effectiveness of their recipe remains highly questionable. Wow. It doesn't smell very good. A good remedy is a remedy that stinks. Huh. You're not wrong. Okay, so that's the last collectible for this chapter. Oh, rats! I don't see. I don't see how. Whoa! Did you see that? The lightning bolt. They're afraid oh, of lightning. Let's try boy. it. Are you kidding? Well, not yet. Let's... Oh my God, we're gonna have to use a lightning. That's fantastic. Saw her step into the rats herself. Whoa. I didn't do that. It's even bigger from here. Let's get in. Come on. See, I should not be responsible for these people. They should just. They should just. Oh my god. Whoa. Huh. Incredible. The tower over there. It's the living quarters. It must be several centuries old. It looks like it's dry, but there's a pit in the way. It's full of rats. It's another trap. There has to be another way to get through. It's open. Well, let's uh, craft some more of this. There we go. They all decided to meet here, it seems. So we can get the rats to move. Lucas, Hugo, stay out of the rain. We'll open up a path to the tower. All right. Come, Hugo. Ready, Melly? As long as we get them out of the way. Mm -hmm. Come on. The siege of Chateau d'Ambrage. Two girls versus thousands of rats. This battle will go down in history. Mm -hmm. Look, they're moving. Mm -hmm. Okay. The central section now. Yes, that's a good first step. I'll let you go first. Cause 
Rats are your thing. Thanks a lot. Oh, yeah. Sure. There's sticks down here. Okay, so I need to go light that thing up. Go on, I'm with you. Great, I feel better already. All right, climb up this ladder. I need Melly to push that. What the hell is this do? Hey, look at that! Oh! Oh, that's cool. Well, I guess that's what the pit's for. That's so cool. Melly, can you get to me? I'm coming. Can't wait to get up there. Look at them. <sighs> The like nobles itself. at the king's court, but it's our castle. <sighs> it's, see, it's like, how cool is this shit? <laughs> oh boy, there we go. Right, those ones have to be driven into the pit too. And of course, they're on the wrong side of the brazier. I'm gonna have to go down and see what's there. All right, I'll cover you with the brazier. Okay. I'm putting my life in your hands, you know. All in a day's work, milady. Whenever you're ready. Can you do it? All right. Safe. We'll all be safe. I I could get up on the rampart. I was thinking I could get up right here, right? Ah. Okay. Ah, here! Here we go. Okay, let's take that. Melly, I'm clearing the outer area. They're coming your way. All right. There are so many of them. We'll never clear a path that way. Right, we need to clear the whole courtyard. Let's get on with it then. Already <sighs> soaked anyway. Should I push this back? Right. Here we go again. Have you done it? Yes. Are you all right, Hugo? I'm fine. Mm -hmm. But they're shouting. <sighs> Don't worry. The storm will drown out our voices. Soon we'll all get to see the tower. Yes. Good luck.
All right, so Wait, should I wants... boost? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna say I'm gonna have to boost her up here. The bridge. We'd better lower it. And so we better indeed. We see the Amazon and Meli the stealthy <laughs> conquered the Chateau d'Ambrage. Huh. You've read too many books. I. Come on. We still have to clean up the area down there. We're going to need the brazier from the ramparts. I'll cover you with this one. All right, I'm going down. Uh, uh, what is it? Nothing, it's just a crappy old lever. Melly, you always know the right thing to say. It's going to be all right. It's your castle. You have a connection. Our castle. Imagine, we could all live here together. I'm more of a Stella girl, you know. All right, so I'm gonna have to go over here and light this little it's a lamp. make some more. Here we go. Alright, so do the same thing again. was right to celebrate our victory would you mind if we get out of the rain please right to the tower we get out of the rain please yes come over to the fire and warm up it's huge we'll have time to explore tomorrow this is our home now Chapter seven. <clears throat> Chapter eight, our home. Probably not for long. That was a 
pretty cool puzzle. We have one, two, three, four collectibles in this chapter. How about some fucking tools? Come on, come on! What's that noise? It's oh! Nice. Follow me! You're Look, all of our collectibles right. that this we have so far have Hopefully. been like put here. here. We'll have to patch up these straw mattresses. Oh, there's a workbench here. Oh, it's got some tools. Tools on the ground. All right, so I can make. Only no longer needs a workshop to upgrade her equipment, but holding more materials. I don't want to do that. Not bad, not bad at all. I'd better stay with Hugo. We've got a lot of work to do. Oh, there's that. Hugo's waiting for me. I'd better go. Okay. Yes, the things we found. This will stop us losing them in all the mess. All right, so first thing here is this icon uh, iconography. Iconography. Alchemy fascinates scientists as much as it inspires artists. The recurring symbol of the line devouring the sun is an allusion to alchemical dissolu uh, dissolution. The purpose of this process, in which vitriol attack sulfur is to separate the crude substances from the subtle ones. Did that go on my thing? No. Okay, let's see here. It's all right, you can come. Where does that lead to? Okay, so this goes all the way down. Oh, I do not want to go down there. There's probably fucking rats down there, bro. Well, not a wink. This laboratory's in bad shape, but it inspired me. I'm on the brink of completing the great work, and you, you can help me. Oh, yes, yes. What do we have to do? Amicia, I need the file from the left-hand table. Uh, all right. On me, on me. What can I do? We need light for the last step. Hugo, go get a candle. I can do that. Yeah. 
Does need a vial of some kind? Oh, this over here. Alchemist lived here. Maybe Laurentius too. Oh, I th that must be it. Here, right. anything else? Uh, yes. A concentrated laurel sap. It's just behind me. I'll get it. What's a great work? Is this right here? Can I eat it? It is the elixir that would Ew. illuminate your path. A beacon Can for I the eat it? of the macula. It came to me during the night. Here. Good. So, the angel's tear. The pinnacle of alchemy. The elixir. You wow! A great work! Uh, it wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, it doesn't matter, Lucas. Perhaps we uh, should let you rest, right, Hugo? Well done, Lucas. You're a sorcerer. Amicia, come on. I'm coming. Okay. By the way, have you seen Melly? No. Uh, she's... Maybe she's already gone. Oh no, I wanted to say goodbye to her. So... The thing says, uh, just behind the area you started, which was inaccessible before in the grass. Was inaccessible before. Oh, this, this? must have been empty f an alchemist crucible. <clears throat> yes, okay, so this here. All right, alchemist crucible. An alchemist's most fundamental tool, the stone container is able to withstand extreme conditions, high furnace temperatures, acids, without eroding or breaking. Throughout the alchemical process, it carries the potential of the of the final great work. All right, nice. Wow. Come on, Amicia. Let's both do it. Ah! <laughs> Having fun, are you? I'm sure the Inquisition are too. Melly, we thought you'd gone. Come on. We need to talk. What's the matter? This castle is a ruin. Ah, and that's exactly what you need. Whoever built this place really didn't want to be fucked with. Be good and you'll be fine. So, you're going to find Arthur? If I can help, he's my problem. You heard what I heard. Those Inquisition dogs took him to the Bastion. I know where to look. I'll find him. Amicia, look! Listen, with Hugo, it doesn't look easy, but believe me, it's worth oh. it. He will save you. They always end up saving us. Even if, you know, brothers, sometimes you just want to kill them. The symbol is Amicia. I believe you. Anyway, don't leave without saying goodbye. <laughs> As if that was my style. Amicia, please come. Yes, Hugo. What did you find? Okay, well, first, of language of birds. grab this. A bird language manual. Oh shit! <laughs> That's that symbol is is not what that is. Al uh, alchemists whose practices are regarded as a cold and dangerous by the majority go to considerable lengths to encrypt their work. Since uh, antiquity, they have used this language of birds, a code based on metaphors, word games, and chirping sounds, as well as mystical symbolism of letters, which re uh, reserves the true meaning of their texts to insiders. Right. Down there. 
All right, you little bastard. What do you want? What drawing? The one in the dining room. I'll show you. Come on. I'm following you. What? Oh, you mean the the bridge thing? Symbols. Went. You're right. Oh yeah. Alchemist coat of arms, maybe. Have you seen the tree? The tree? Come on, over here. <laughs> Come back. Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> you found new friends. Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sick. No, no, no. Yeah, like, look at his neck, dude. It's getting worse, bro. Look at that. It looks so bad. It's so coursing its way up his face. There's Lucas and Melly now, you know? Lucas, come see the butterflies. Looks like someone's having a good time. <laughs> it's getting bigger. <laughs> yeah, clearly. Yes. I've been saying that the for a while now. spreading through his blood. The books say there are several thresholds in the process. And at each threshold, the carrier may be lost. How much time do we have? Very little. Hugo is nearing the first threshold. My master and your mother were trying to slow the process down. But how? What were they doing? They were working on a very complex elixir that would allow him time to prepare. And do you know how to do it? I don't have their knowledge, but their work was inspired by a forbidden book. The Sanguinis Itinera. So perhaps with the book? I'm afraid could... not. The Sanguinis Itinera is dangerous. It is sealed together with other works in the university basement. Just getting there would be near impossible. Suicidal even. Normally, yes. But if we take advantage of the current chaos, we might have a chance. I know the place. It's in town not far from where they keep my brother. If you're ready to take that risk, I can help you get in. Thank you. Right. I'll get my belongings together. Meet me inside when you want to leave. In that case, you'll need some equipment. I'll get it ready. Hugo? I'm really sorry. I need to leave. Don't worry. I'll stay with Lucas. Good. Oh, I'll thank be back God soon. we don't need to take him with us. Father? Mother? You'll always be here. With us. What have you found? Here, it's St. John's Wart. Oh. It will protect you when you go to the town. Must be powerful stuff. Yes, it's a very good flower. It looks good on you. <laughs> Thank you. St. John's Wart. Also called St. John's Herb, it is a symbol of animosity and also one of protection and light. St. John's Wart is considered a remedy to melancholy and other mental afflictions. Despite its nickname, Devil Hunter... Adjusting it can still significantly disrupt the heart rate, causing arrhythmia and tachycardia. <laughs> Just don't need it. Okay. I'm so glad that we do not have to. Alright, so... Um... Technically, I can upgrade that again. <laughs> so, let me see. Is Lucas going to have something for me then? Be 
careful in town. It's probably more chaotic than here. Don't worry. We girls know how to handle ourselves. I'm sure you do. Good luck, nonetheless. I thought you said you were going to have some stuff for me. Alright, I'm not going to craft anything until I really need it, to be honest. I do want to come down here, though. Oh, a grave. Just hear Hugo laughing. So there's nothing down here. Strange. Okay. So let's talk to Melly and uh, get the fuck out of here. I think that's actually the end of this chapter. Pretty short chapter. Nothing really... Nothing to do, really. It's really just kind of a... I think this is like a home base establishment. So, like, we'll come back here after maybe like a couple chapters or something. But it's cool to see all this stuff. Just uh, kind of here that we've gotten... At last. All right, come on. Here. And one last thing. Laurenti has told oh, okay. me once that there are roses scattered along the path to the book. So keep your eyes open. Roses. All right, we will. Easy as that. All right, chapter nine. In the shadow of ramparts. So there's four collectibles in this chapter, as well as another alchemist cart. Um, yeah. So obviously you guys have seen the way I've been doing this, doing uh, essentially two chapters per video, so... We're gonna, after this cutscene here, we're gonna leave it off. And uh, we'll come back. The first rule of survival is hidden time. between the legs. Wouldn't the head be quicker? You're way too soft. Shh, there are the town ramparts. All right, so next time we will, uh, we'll head into the town ramparts. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. Uh, thank you for watching and take care of yourselves. Goodbye.